the gap, three seconds exactly between himself and Troy Corsa in second place. Fabrizio's under pressure still from Neukirchner, but it doesn't look as though Neukirchner's got anything left in the tank. The, what we've got to watch now is Smirts. He's the guy that can um, lose his position because Muggeridge is right on his rear wheel, and that's where the fireworks is going to be. Checker has just got to get his way around. He'll have his fingers crossed, he'll have his toes crossed, his shoelaces crossed, and everything crossed. He's going to just get to the line, and that'll be his first World Superbike win. Well, he, it's the first time he's been to the USA at this circuit. Of course, has raced in MotoGP, but now has a chance to lay claim to his first ever. He's had four podiums previous to this, came closest to winning at Valencia, but the man on his rookie season in World Superbikes is about to put his name in the big book. Hear it, feel it, love it. That's the theme at Miller Motorsport, and that's exactly how Carlos is feeling right now. Yep, only a few corners to go for the first win, and this team are going to relish in it, because let's face it, this bike is a brand new bike this year. They've done a lot of work, and um, it's going to pay off for them today. Just two corners to go then for Carlos Checa, and the Spaniard is flying high. The hombre has come to town. I told you he meant business. You saw his face at the beginning of the morning. He came here with one clear intention, and that was to win in America. They like winners in America, and Carlos Checker is about to become one. On the power, gingerly taking out the last corner. Onto the main straight he comes, and Carlos Checker 